two bodies move along the x-axis. Their coordinates change according to the formulas you can see on the screen. Describe the movements. Plot the x1 versus t versus time and x2 versus t graphs. At what point in time will the bodies meet? Find the coordinate of the meeting point. So, equation of motion of the first body is x1 equals 4 plus 0.5 times t x2 equals 8 minus 1.5 times t. We have to describe these motions and plot x1 with respect to t, x2 versus t, and find the point in time where bodies meet, time of meeting, Tm, and find the coordinate of the meeting point, Xm. Well, what does it mean to describe the movements? We should find the initial position of both bodies and their velocities or their speed. To answer the question, let us write down the standard formula for uniform motion in a straight line. x versus t equals x0 plus where v x times t. So, x0 is the initial position, initial coordinate of a body. Vx is a component of the speed, of the velocity of the body. First body. Compare the initial position of the first body is 4 meters. The velocity Vx equals 0 0.5 meters per second and pay attention, plus means that body moves along the x-axis. The second initial coordinate x02 equals 8 meters and vx vx equals minus 1.5 meters per second. So, since here the minus sign, we can say this body moves in the opposite direction when compared to the direction of x-axis. Opposite or x-axis. This is description. Both bodies move in a straight line uniformly, the first along x-axis, the second in the opposite direction. Now, <clears throat> let's plot graphs. Vertical axis is for coordinate. Horizontal axis is for time. x meters stands for coordinate, 
T seconds stands for time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now you should choose the scale for x-axis. Look, the greatest value of x is 8. So let's use this information. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and the greatest 8. The graph which describes uniform motion coordinate versus time is a straight line. To plot a straight line we need two points of this line. For example, for the first body one point corresponds to the initial position when time equals zero, coordinate equals four. the first. Then the, uh, the second uh, point of the straight line can be calculated if we substitute any time in this formula. For example, if we use 4 or 6, 6, 6 seconds, when time equals 6 seconds, here we have 3 meters plus for seven meters. Six seconds, seven meters. And now across these two points we can draw the straight line. First body. The second body at the initial, mo uh, initial moment in time have, uh, has the coordinate 8. Now let's use a moment in time, the moment in time, uh, for example, 3 seconds or 4 seconds, 4 seconds. If we use 4 seconds, 4 times 1.5 is 6. 8 minus 6 gives 2. 4 seconds. 2 meters. Here is the second point of the straight line. And now let's draw this line. Second. Okay, now we can answer the question at what point in time will the bodies meet? Meeting is an event when at the same moment in time bodies have the same coordinates. Look here. Moment in time when two lines intersect corresponds the event of meeting. T m equals two seconds. And what coordinate we have at this moment? Coordinate is graphically it gives approximate value about five meters. This is x m coordinate of meeting. So we can write t m equals two seconds x m coordinate of meeting point is five meters. This was graphical method, but much more accurate is the result of analytical method. 
method of calculation. Let us use this method to solve the same problem. What is meeting? Meeting is the event when at the same moment in time bodies have the same coordinates. So we can write x1 at the moment of meeting equals x2 at the same moment and equals x of meeting. Now let's substitute these two formulas into meeting condition. We have 4 plus 0 0.5 Tm paying attention. No T but Tm time of meeting equals 8 minus 1.5 also Tm. We have an equation and let's find the solution of these, uh, this equation. So here move it to the right, this term move to the left part and we'll have 0 0.5 Tm plus this minus converts into plus 0 0.5 Tm equals 8 here plus after movement minus 4 or 2 Tm equals 4 or Tm equals 4 divided by 2 2 seconds. The same result as when using graphical method. Now we can find the coordinate of meeting point substituting this time in any of these two formulas. For example, to the first x meeting gives 4 plus 0 0.5 Tm2 gives us 4 plus 1, 5 meters. And to check ourselves, let's repeat the substitution, but to the second formula. Xm equals 8 minus 1.5 times 2 gives 8 minus 3 gives the same 5 meters. Correspond. So the problem is solved.